Hello guys, today I will be reviewing the NES uh, Nintendo Entertainment System Sapper from 1985. You can't see that because my camera. <coughs> this is a, a light gun, well at least what people like to call it. When you shoot it at the screen, the screen becomes black with a white square where the targets are and if the light sensing thing comes out and if it hits the target, it, it'll hit the target. Simple as that. Um, I wish they still used the system today, because this is the kind of system we see in arcade games. Like, uh, I don't know, but you, you see it, you know what I mean. Like in arcade games where you're shooting things. I think that's the kind of technology they use. Um, this is the orange model before they had the gray one, but that looked too real, so they made it orange. So, it, so... It looked more toyish, I guess, but you have to actually look down the sights for this, uh, for this zapper. Um, every system had their own version, but I like the NES version the most. And I only have one game compatible with it, compatible with it, and that's Duck Hunt. So let's get a good view of Duck Hunt. Alright, there's the TV. Turn on Duck Hunt. Alright. And to select your game, you just point down. See? You just point down with the gun and shoot. I'll do one duck for you. Alright, here's round one. Yeah, I missed that one, but you get the idea. It's a really good. Uh, my, I was, I'm lucky to get a good one that works. There's only one problem with it. You have to pull the trigger a little bit to the left when you shoot. That's all. You get three shots for it. I'll do my own separate review of Duck Hunt. Um. But yeah, that's the NES Zapper. Thank you for watching.